I was kind of like young and cocky and wide open, you know, and he was the, the intimidator. I found myself racing Earnhardt a lot. We've got a war for first place. It's Earnhardt and Wallace. Doesn't get the better than this. The battle for the championship is enjoying right here. Remember, Earnhardt leads Wallace by 72 points. kind of rivalry going a little bit but it wasn't this this hate thing you know we got along good he went hey, that's pretty good kid I, I kind of like how you did that you know i pride myself thinking that i had a pretty cool relationship with the guy we got speed up. somebody made a joke about selling t-shirts i never forget he grabbed a hold of me said don't let these guys lead you down a dirt road you take care of yourself you pat your name he said, you know, I'm going to negotiate my own deals. I'm going to help build this industry. And he was the guy that basically got this merchandise thing off and running. He was one of the first guys to get in there and go, hey, I'm going to patent my name. I'm going to use my name. I'm not going to give my name away to people. And I'm going to have control of my destiny when it comes to the merchandising end of it. Just a, a really cool guy in that, that aspect. We did talk quite often, and, uh, and so I feel like I understood him more than most.